welcome to this rainy evening on homestead so i have a few plans but they definitely do not involve the rain so i kind of want to start um oh it's still loading in the world's still loading in there <laughs> so what i want to do is i want to be able to start like growing fruit trees and growing our different crops and everything but in order to do that we need the actual crops and in order to get the actual crops we kind of have to buy the crops from our little um Pam's Harvest Craft market thingy that is just, it's just back right over here, right over here. So, um, the crops all cost diamonds, you got, I mean, diamond, emeralds. They cost emeralds. Every single crop cost emeralds, but then I think the, oh, you can even buy spawn eggs, but the trees cost three emeralds. So, we're gonna be having to do a lot of villager trading to get emeralds, but there's really not a lot of fantastic villages around here. So I think what we should do is maybe uh, craft ourselves a little bit of a trade wagon, hook up one of our horses, and ride on over and find other villages. Or at the very least, craft ourselves a backpack and then forge in the immediate area, and then what we cannot find, go and to other villages and trade for emeralds to then get the seeds but okay it's getting it's getting real late real late Rue let's uh let's go upstairs and without falling off the ladder and go to bed now that it has stopped raining I think let's go ahead and let's go look into how to make a trade wagon oh that's that's not what I wanted to do there we go e okay hit the e key sable uh <laughs> wagon this the covered wagon so we are going to need wool which is not a problem we have plenty of sheep but we are going to have to get some planks also not a problem a chest a bed not a problem but uh, it is the cart and the wheel so we're going to have to make four wheels like two for this one two for the other one the sticks that's all not a problem so the wheel Actually, we really do have everything that we need to make. No creepers spawned, right? I don't see any creepers, but let's keep the sword out. Actually, for creepers, we probably should we probably should use a bow. But okay, let's go to our little crafting windmill uh, storage thingy, majiggy, and let's go ahead. And I always check in here, even though I have it all lit up. I still am suspicious, you know? I still walk in with the, the sword at the ready. I'm ready to defeat any creepers that decided to make my windmill their home. But, so it looks like what we really are just going to need are sticks. So let's grab a few of these. 10 should do the job. And then we're going to need a smidgen of iron. Let's just grab six because why not? And then I think we're gonna need our, I feel like we're missing some tools here. I feel like we're definitely missing some tools here. Where are our tools? Where's my work blade? What is happening? What? Somebody stole my work blade. I will find you and I will take it back. Well, I cannot seem to find my iron work blade. I put so much effort into making that iron work blade. I honestly don't know what happened to it, you guys. I don't. Please tell me in the comments if you saw in any past videos, if you saw where I put my iron work blade because I'm getting real sad right now. Just real sad. Okay, so apparently we're gonna have to use the flint work blade significant downgrade okay and so then all we have to do is uh pop those in there pop that in there then that makes some sticks and that should be enough sticks but let's just bring the flint work seriously where is it I'm <laughs> all of my iron tools disappeared i swear you guys we have some kleptomaniac that comes into our windmill and steals our tools what is going on but alrighty, so that should be... Okay, so we just need a little iron... A little ingot... No, the little the little nuggets. That's it. We need the iron nuggets. So then if we do that with the iron nuggets... That's four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four and four. Okay, there we go. That makes four wheels. And that should be enough. Okay, that's one wheel. So in order to make this cart, we're going to need more sticks and more planks do we have enough planks to make this we do we have enough planks to make that cart perfect and so then 
We're going to need a chest, a bed, more wool. So wool, 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 wood, and all, all the stuff, just all the stuff. But in order to get some more wool, we are going to have to go and shear our sheep because I am fresh out of wool. So let's head over to the pasture. Oh, there we go. Let's head over to the pastures over here and start shearing some sheep. This is the kind of stuff I live for. I love me. It's just some work on the farm. Oh, these actually are the uh, Pam's Harvest Craft little garden things. We'll definitely have to remember to come over and break those and take them with us because I think um, I think we can get um, food, food and stuff out of them. But also while we are in the barn, I think it is time we let some of the horses out to just go and have a nice time out in the field. We have this gorgeous field for them. Why not just let them out and enjoy themselves? So okay, you can go out, you can go out. Uh, all of these horses need names, by the way. Every single one of them needs a name. Okay, let's just open, 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 open. Hi, little sheep. Oh, little... Oh, the sheep are coming in here to eat the, the horse's wheat. Oh my goodness, you little piggy sheep. You got all this grass. There's no way you need more wheat. Okay, uh, what were we doing? Oh yeah, we were out here to shear you. So thank you. Um, thank you for your donation. Thank you for your donation and your donation and yours. Alrighty, there we go. That should be plenty of wool. I think that is something that we should do pretty much every spring summer time frame is to come out and shear the sheep and get all of the wool that we possibly can because we don't really want to be shearing them in the winter because it is so so cold their poor little little skinny sheep bodies can't handle the cold so I think definitely during the spring and summer those are the months we should be getting all of the wool that we are going to be needing so I think then what we do is we take this like so and then it turns into normal brown wool uh, ooh, we need some, we need more planks to make a bed that should be plenty uh, so then we come over here and let's make a bed Perfect, we have got a bed, and now I think we need a bit of a chest, and then what else did we need? So we needed the wool, we needed two of those, two of the, what are we missing? It has to be a white, really, it has to be a white bed. Okay then, let's make a white bed. There we go, are you satisfied, Animania? It is now a white bed. Perfect. So we have our covered wagon, but then I think I also kind of just wanted to make some, another another cart so i definitely think we should let's just make another cart there we go this cart actually will be very very useful for us around the farm it will definitely we can hook up some of the horses to it and then that will actually help us uh that wool goes there this wool goes there and that would actually help us get around and like move supplies a little bit easier and i'm actually wondering if uh we're able to put um, animals in the car. I mean, cause how useful would that be in order to like transport, like say all of our chickens, if we were able to just go ahead and just put a whole bunch of chickens in our cart, that'd be fantastic. But it is also almost nighttime. I am going to uh, throw all these supplies back in here and then I will see you guys back at the house. Oh, alrighty, all of the storage is sorted. So I think uh, let's go ahead and place down this wagon. I really want to know what it looks like. I'm so excited, you guys. I mean, oh, hello, Mr. Skeleton. Don't mind if I do. Let's see if we can hit him from here, you guys. I'm curious. Can I hit him from here? Oh, just short, just short. <gasps> almost, almost, almost. Boom! We got him. Oh, I threw the bow. I threw the bow. Come back to me, little bow. This is the problem, you guys. Uh, in my spare time, I actually quite enjoy playing uh, Ark Survival Evolved. And in order to uh, unequip a weapon, you hit Q. But in Minecraft, to uh, unequip a weapon, you just scroll off of it. So, But hitting Q actually makes you throw the item. So I will be throwing my stuff an awful lot because I've been playing too much Ark. Okay, there we go. We got bones. We got arrows. Always excellent. Always needing those arrows. Ooh, our shovel's almost broken. So let's go ahead and let's maybe, I think uh, this might be a nice spot for the wagon. Oh, 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 hello. Wow, that is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Let's see if we can, we can we grab it? Oh, we can grab it. Oh, we can move it around ourselves too. Okay, let's see, can we get it into a little bit of a, a better, 
um, position like over here. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Animania, you have outdone yourself. Oh my gosh. We can get in the wagon. We can get in the wagon. Oh my god, this is so cool. Oh, there's a bed. There's a lamp. There's a little storage chest. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. We can sleep at night too. I didn't know. I didn't want to do that. Turn around. Turn yourself around. This awesome, awesome wagon. Oh my goodness gracious. This is probably the coolest thing I have ever seen in Minecraft. And I've seen an awful lot of things in Minecraft. Okay, can we can we just uh just like roll you back a little a little more? Just a little more. There we go. I think that is actually the perfect spot for our wagon to just sit and rest for now. But also we do, oh, I have some food on me, good. But we also do have this horse cart. And so I think this will be extremely useful. Look at it. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. This is so cool. Oh, can we, oh, we can, you guys, I can give people little wagon rides. Oh my gosh. I can hook the cart up to myself. This is adorable. This is, this is everything. This is just making my day, oh my goodness. But I think better than hooking ourselves up would be actually to hook a horse up to the wagon. So let's go over and maybe be very careful because obviously there are skeletons in the area. I don't think there's actually, I don't see anything else. But let's go and grab our lovely, lovely mare, Cinnamon. And maybe let's hook Cinnamon up to the cart. Actually, Cinnamon, let's grab you a saddle as well. Just because it's easier to move horses uh, when you're actually riding them. There. Oh, hey, buddy. Yeah, I'm just gonna let you burn out there. Go ahead. I'll wait. No, don't go into the shade. Come back here. I want to. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so Cinnamon, come with me, my girl. And let's go and. Okay, for a second I thought that this was a foal, but it's not. It's just a mare. Okay, good. I was gonna have a complete, like, freak out moment that we had another horse. And I'm like, I don't want any more horses. Alrighty, Cinnamon, let's go this way. Follow me, follow me. Oh, and you got, you got stuck, Cinnamon. Really? Really? Come, come, come here. Come here. There we go. Come on. Let's go, Cinnamon. Oh, you guys, this is so cool. Okay, Cinnamon, can you work your way? There we go, there we go. Bloop! Oh, no. No, how- I, I don't want the wagon. I want Cinnamon on the- Please. Please. Um, this is not what I intended. This is the exact opposite of what I intended. I don't want to be the one pulling the horse. The horse should be the one pulling me. What is happening? <laughs> Aha! We have got it now, so I have to ride Cinnamon and then she will pull the car. I, I get it, I get it. Look at this, you guys, look at us, we're so cool! Okay, uh, okay, Cinnamon, um, let's go. So, can the cart make it over- that cart can make it over items. This is- oh, this is everything, you guys. Come on, little cart, let's go! <gasps> this is so cool. This is so cool, look at us! Oh my goodness, this is the best, you guys. This is absolutely the best thing I've ever seen. But now the question is, how many chickens can we put in this cart? Because obviously once we are able to pull the cart, the next stage in this quest is, how many chickens can we put in the cart, obviously. So I think we should definitely go and try to figure out how many chickens exactly we can put in this cart. There we go, okay, Cinnamon, I'm just gonna, Cinnamon, we're, Cinnamon. Really? Girl? Not the most loyal horse, that's for sure. Cinnamon! Come back, you all- Cinnamon! 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 Cin no, 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 no! Come here. Come here, you pesky horse. Come on, girl. You can do it. You can do it! There we go. Okay, so apparently you gotta hook Cinnamon up here, otherwise she will just run away with the cart. Got it. Um, you just stay- just calm down. Calm down, girl. Okay, uh, chicken number one. Can we, oh, we can put the chicken in the cart. Oh, we can put the chicken in the cart. This is the best. <gasps> we can put another chicken in the cart. We, we can put two chickens in the cart. We can put two chickens in the cart. Oh my god, this is the best. <laughs> How, let's play a game. How many chickens can, turkey? No, turkey, turkey. Come back here, come back here. You little, no, 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 turkey. Thank you, right there. I don't- I don't want the feathers. I don't want the feathers. 
Okay, chicken, I'm, I'm gonna pick you up and let's go. Uh, put that there. Oh, I put three chickens in the car. Put three chickens in the car. Yes, we're putting three chickens in the car. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, uh, how many more chickens can we put in the cart? Here we go. Okay, that- Oh no! We can, oh, we can put- we can put a lot of chickens in the cart, you guys. We can put a lot of chickens in the cart. Look at them. Look at them. <laughs> oh, this is just absolutely making my day. Oh my gosh. But alright, you guys, I think that is actually going to be it for today's episode of Homestead. I honestly, I, I can't right now. This is just literally the best thing I've ever found in Minecraft. This is just absolutely making my day. I will get back to you in the next episode on exactly how many chickens you can put in the car, but I'm guessing it's going to be a lot, you guys. This is Cinnamon. Cinnamon, calm down. Cinnamon's freaking out. She's like, no, don't make me pull all these chickens in the cart. But as always, you guys, thank you so, so much for tuning in and watching this episode of Homestead. This has probably been one of my favorite episodes, honestly, because all the chickens in the cart. Who doesn't want all the chickens in the cart? Okay, as always, you guys, please remember to subscribe if you are new to my channel. I put out videos almost every single day, and I will see you next week for the next episode of Homestead, where we actually take cinnamon out and we go from town to town and we trade with villagers for emeralds. Okay, you guys, until then, goodbye.